market to market to buy a fat hog. Home again, home again. Jiggity jog. We will overcome this together. We are better together. Saturday morning things. Hey, Bonnie. It's moving some hay. I'm going to get some more hay today. Well, we got hay. Well, we've got one one load of hay coming here, and then he's going to pick up another load. So, so we're just we're just about out. At least we have resources. We have resources. We're not going to run out, which is a good feeling. It's just not a good feeling to have to buy it, but got to do what you got to do. Well, it's Saturday morning, but it's kind of like Christmas. We just stopped at the post office. We got some goodies. Thank you. Look at these cute little alligator mitts to get things out of the oven. Where's the beef? These are so cute. These were made by Linda Holmes in Ontario, Canada. She sells these and makes these. I'll be glad to put her email address in the description if you want to check those out. Super cute. Thank you, Linda. Those will come in handy. Cam Moran, if I said that right. This is the most perfect sign for me. Butter makes it better, y'all. Yes. This will be going up. I love it. Thank you. And what are the you kids? The kids got blow pops and a tic-tac-toe game board thank you they love that what do y'all say thank you. thank you with his mouth full and to mr hutchison thank you for this sweet little book on the psalm on psalm 23 i can't wait to read it y'all are great we appreciate your gifts mm -hmm. and your kindness mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we do <laughs> yes yes ma'am and yes sir we do Thank y'all. Thank you. All right, now, let's go do some stuff. almost like a regular lot again.
<laughs> what are you doing up in that seat? Waiting for a ride. Mmm. Getting all snuggly. You smell like manure. Well, I've probably been eating it. Mmm, <laughs> my little snuggle book. Okay, heading out. And of course, I just saw a pileated woodpecker fly right by. Totally missed it. One day, one day I'm going to get him on video or her. Yeah. So, I've decided I'm going to make one hopefully final run to the grocery store to get some things. It looks like we are in for possibly an extended stay at home along with a lot of of other Americans and well people across the world that are dealing with this virus I do know it is serious people are dying it's very contagious I understand that so we are going to do our part to stay as isolated as we can and keep doing what we do which is farm um, I don't think I've ever been as glad to live on a farm as I am right now and to be able to have this to focus on and just keep doing what we do on a daily basis and keep raising our animals and trying to keep things going here and I just I hope and pray that you all stay well be safe be smart don't take any unnecessary precautions I hope that if you have elderly family and friends, that they stay safe and um, that if you have opportunities to be a helper in your community, that you can do that. I'm gonna try to do the same. Got some things to do this week to try to help some people. So uh, I think that's all we can do. We can pray that this, that we can ride this out and that it's, the impact is not huge I worry if I worry about anything other than lives being lost it's our economy that is somewhat worrisome <laughs> but we are strong people we're a strong nation we will overcome this together we are better together and um, I think if we can just remember that and not panic, not panic. I've seen so much fear and so much panic in people, people's faces, out in public, people online. I'm just trying to distance myself from that and uh, just remain focused on what I know, what I can do, what I have control over. Trust in a God who has control over us all. He has us right here and um, we'll make it through this. So, stay safe, be well, praying for you, praying for us all, and um, I'm gonna go see if I can find some ice cream and butter and sugar, the essentials, to make it through this. <laughs> to market, to market, to buy a fat pig, home again, home again, jiggity jig. To market, to market, to buy a fat hog, home again, home again, jiggity jog. My mom said that every time we pull in the driveway, and I just always feel like saying it when I pull into my home away from home. How much water? Okay, so evidently we're doing some kind of arts and crafts here. Hydro dipping. Hydro dipping. Is hydro dipping a phone okay. cover? Okay. I mean, did you watch a video on this or something? Yeah, we watched lots of videos. And it's oh. Oh. Get back. It's like they're kind of counseling each other out. Oh. It's filming Christmas. Okay, that's the reason why. Yeah. Your hydro dip tray. <laughs> <laughs> And this is pretty much how arts and crafts goes yeah. on our farm. <laughs> well, I've been busy doing some other things today. Oh, I'm really tired, y'all. But I wanted to come see what Hubs is doing. 
And we've gone from pushing sand to pushing dirt. That was mud. That still is mud. <laughs> But man, this looks better. If you've been around for any length of time, you know how bad this lot was. I mean, it kind of still is. <laughs> but this is better. He's getting a lot of those ruts out and um, this is good. This is progress. <laughs> so, did she just jump out the window, Bonnie, to get the gate? I'm pretty sure she did. Are you trying to be all Dukes of Hazard like? Is that what you're doing? Wait, what? Do you know the show Dukes of Hazard? Mm -mm, Bo and Luke Duke. I've never heard of it. I definitely failed as a parent. The only way they got in and out of their car, the General Lee. Jumping through it. The orange General Lee. You've seen that. Right? That show with the orange car? Well, I've never seen the show. I've seen the car, though. <laughs> Gosh. Okay, well, we're going to have to <laughs> rectify that, I reckon. Sure is nice having a gate boss. That's not me. Thank you for using the door. <laughs> that one time. That's the ultimate neck scratcher, isn't it, girl? I missed it. She was rubbing her neck, huh? Yeah, she was like... <laughs> they do that a lot. That cable. You see it moving. Mm-hmm. And she just did it. She, she's got a split ear there where a tag, tag went all the way through. Or rip, rip the tag off is what I'm trying to say. Huh? Bonnie, are you rotten? Just a uh, little? No, Mom. Just a little, maybe? Just a wee tiny little <laughs> bit? Girl. Nope. Not rotten at all. <laughs> hey. Hey, mamas. Hey, babies. Is that good stuff? Huh? Yeah? You know what? We just gave y'all that hay this morning. Holy wow. Y'all are sucking it down like vacuum. Oh my goodness, look at this little face right here. Look at him, watch his nose. His little nose was going up and down. <laughs> I see you too. I can just sit here and watch him for quite a while and be very content. You getting curious? Yeah? I don't have any feed. Sorry. <laughs> Their little noses. I got them. This is highly entertaining, especially if you're sitting right here. <laughs> but you are sitting right here. You're watching it. So you're basically with us. Yeah. <sighs> Except for the odor. You don't you don't have the odor. Mm. Doesn't bother me though, I love it. I really do, y'all. Alright. Catch y'all in the morning. I mean, see you in the morning. Hopefully we don't have to catch you. <laughs> Please stay in your your fence. <laughs> Bonnie, why did you follow us? Huh? Um, everything needs hay this morning. Everybody's out. So, we're gonna get that done. It's just kind of a wild day. A lot, a lot going on, a lot needs to get done.
starving, Ma. Thanks. Man, he did a really good job blading this lot. Got everything he could except for right there where it was really, really, really deep. Really, really muddy. Sure looks better. swing after I throw these and I'm gonna swing off and throw it. Okay, we're popping water balloons for fun. Go ahead. You got some poop. Okay, I have a Three, yellow one. Two, one, go. It's pink, Mama. You just said yellow. Pink. I can't, yeah. It's purple. Actually, this okay. is pink. Alright. So that's okay. one. Okay. Okay. Whee! Ooh. Very good. <laughs> oh, lost a hat. <laughs> you gonna lay down and eat, Bonnie? Yes, because it's such a hard life. It's and this, like a good this life is a dad. good life. You're right. It's a good life for her. She she has it really rough, don't you, Bonnie? <laughs> I mean, nothing like laying down at the trough. At the trough. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well be. Oh, me. <laughs> Ooh. $7 swing still coming in, coming in handy. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, let's go finish some school. <laughs> 